Welcome to the stream. Old character. Ah, there we go. I can't remember which one I was, uh, which character I was going with, for, with. So we're just gonna choose this one. I did not mean to make do that. I did not mean to throw a fireball. Oh well. Okay. First, let's check on my crops. All I have because it is almost the next season. I can't be... No! There we go. Fly to Nelvari Farms. Right. Ah. All right. Onward we go. Clearly, I already did that conduit. And this one... Uh... I must wait get my mana back.
Return to Iris. All right. Wait, where is Iris? Ah, uh, over there. Alrighty. To Iris and talk to her about the mana. Uh, so it's best if Novari stays hidden. Thanks, Iris. Uh, next up, we need to find Vaughn. He is over by his house. Which is off to the side. Over here. Hello, Vaughn. Hello there, Alexi. You, you're here because Nivara asked you to come, aren't you? Gorwin told me everything about your lesson on perspective along with my place in it. That's a lot... There's a lot you can learn from Nivara's lessons here in Nelvari, but I also know there's a lot more you can learn outside of Nelvari. Nivara can teach you a lot, but at the same time, don't feel held back. Do you know what I mean? I'll tell you what, this is my test. I've hidden something out, uh, just outside of Nelvari. If you find it, you'll pass my test. It'll be easy for sure, I'm sure. I'll find it. Hey. Ooh. Pretty sure that's what he wanted me to find, uh, because that wasn't there before. Let's not waste our mana. Even though it gets us to places quicker, it is also money. Alright, Alexi, it seems you passed my test. Well done. I'll leave you with this. Ne Navara told me that Gorwin has pre prepared a special task for you. Best of luck with your lessons and with the wising up. Thanks for letting me know. Goodbye, Vaughn. I am a little dragon running around. I have wings and a tail and horns. Wind lift. Up we get. Hello, Gorwin. Ah, uh, hello, Alexi. How's your training with Nivari? Oh, I'm sorry, Alexi. I wasn't expect. I was. I was not expecting to be part of your lesson. Vaughn is. Quite fond of his pranks as usual, ho ho. But you are here, so let's. So let me tell you this, Alexi. There are many who live in Nelvari, and each of them feels a certain way. They are equally valid to me. Some value hiding from the world, and I respect their reasons why. Others wish to see the bra the world and brave the potential threats outside. I do not discourage them either. I am the Elder, and it's 
and all of the perspectives n must n not only be known to me, but acknowledged. It is something... Uh, it is something my young apprentice Wesley is having a trouble grasping, but I still remember when I was young myself. I believe his ability to understand the perspectives and believe in yours as well. As, as for your special task? Hmm. Oh. Well, how about this? R return to uh, Nivara and tell her that I send my greetings. Ho ho, you got it, Gorwin. Down we go. Down we go, down we go, down we go. Down we go. I don't know my- I don't know why my brain is... ...continuously repeating the things I've heard, even if it's just my own voice. Welcome back, Alexei. How was your time with Iris and Vaughn? Vaughn pranked me, but Elder Gorwin sends his greetings. You think you catch the faintest glimpse of a grin in the world dragon's eyes, though her composure remains otherwise completely intact. Now what do we do now? First, I wish you to ask you one more thing, Alexei. What is your perspective? Should Nelvari stay elusive and hidden, or shall Nelvari open itself to the world? I think it should open itself. I see. Opening oneself to the world comes with many possibilities for opportunity, but also risk. I wonder if you have answered the same way had I asked you before you began this lesson. Please reflect on what those you have spoken to have told you. Try to understand their perspective. I think I understand. Now, you have done well, little Sprout, and your lesson is complete. I hope you now understand the importance of perspective. Now then, when you are prepared to for the next lesson, come seek me again. Dude. I'm ready for the next lesson, gimme, gimme. Are you prepared to begin your next lesson? I am ready, Navara. Everyone sees the world through, through their own perspective. A single perspective is only a single way of seeing the world. Many perspectives lead to a more complete understanding. No matter how different something or someone is, you can find commonality with it if you are willing to look. Most of the citizens of Nelvari are welcoming of your presence, but what about one who is not? Alexei, seek them. When you are, it, when you re find that you re you reach a common alley, come back to me. Ah, was it so obvious that it was Wesley at, of who I spoke? Nivara's eyes narrow slightly, and a soft snort escapes from her snout. A laugh? I know how the Elder's assistant can think sometimes, and how he feels. Regardless of any misgivings you might harbor, approach Wesley with a willingness to see his perspective. You will find that you have more in common than either of you may think. You should be able to find him at the Tavern of the Great Tree at the moment. Okay, Nivara. I don't like him, but I'll try at least. We can always try.
Uh, what do you want to talk to me for? Commonality, huh? Listen, I don't have any time for something like that. Besides, it's a bad idea anyways. You can train with Nav Navarra all you want, but I have work to do. Hmm. That's understandable. Hmm. Oh wait, I need to go up, see Gorwin. Let's see if Gorwin can, uh... Broke. Oh, hello there, Alexi. You need me for something. Uh, what is the deal with Wesley? Hmm. I cannot tell you. I cannot. I didn't think of that this moment will come. Ho ho. Wesley has a lot to worry about. Though perhaps it's just an excuse to ma I make for him. Admittedly. He admittedly has to a few things in order to learn, be in order to become elder. What do you see in Wesley? That's a fair, qu a very fair question, and one I bear responsibility to answer. Wesley cares deeply for our Nelvari traditions, deeper than anyone else can ex anyone else, including myself, more than, more than actually. Wesley wants to watch Nelvari and its all of its people thrive. The way he seeks to accomplish this, however, is through long-standing tradition of some which has not aged well, it seems. When I selected him to, as my apprentice, I was he was full of hope and eagerness. Oh, ho, ho, ho. But now I worry that his own fears have turned him sour. Perhaps I have failed to be there to guide him when he needed it. He seems like he has some growing to do. He has much to learn, and I have much to teach him. Perhaps it's time he learned something truly important. Hmm, yes, Alexi. Maybe you coming to Nelvari really was fate. I wouldn't be surprised if Nelvari thought so, too. Oh ho, perhaps this was Wesley's lesson just as much as yours. Wesley lets his pride and duty get better of him. He doesn't like to accept, accept help, either. He worked very hard to prepare your farm for you, did you know? Of course you didn't, since you didn't show it. The way what Wesley asks acts doesn't earn him many friends or much thanks for the work that he does. From the moment I put him on the task, Wesley worked every single day to get the home and land ready for you. Tending to the grounds, making sure the old farmhouse is more co a comfortable abode. Though he had quite a trouble dealing with how quickly the weeds uh, re would regrow, you hardly believe he. Da -da -da -da. Perhaps there was. Perhaps there's something you can do to, as a show of good will to Nelvari. Thank you. Hold on. Briefly cut gem. All right. Away we go. <sighs> Donate to the... A thousand? Holy crap. Where's the donation box? Oh, there's the, the donation box.
Oh my god, it's gonna take a while. That gave me two mana orbs. Well, this is going to take a while. Might as well tend to my farm. Hello! How's it going? Welcome to my stream. Uh, we are playing Sunhaven today. Uh, you can find a link to my Twitter in the description and uh, a little bit of a... Yeah. I... I hope you enjoy. I did not wake up with the brain cell today, so I hope you... Uh... uh I stream... I do stream regularly, yes. Um, I stream every Sunday, Monday, Thursday, and Friday. At, uh, 5 p.m. PST. Uh, PST is Pacific Standard Time. Do, 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 do. Okay, um, I'm gonna clean this up. I need to chop down some of these trees. It's getting a little hectic. And then I go to my uh, Sunhaven farm and tend to the crops. Uh, 5 p.m. That would be 3 a.m. for me then. Oh, no. I'm so sorry about that. Hang on. It's like... Are you saying it's 3.30 a.m. right now for you? Uh, love to have you here. Why are you up so early? <laughs> Uh, can't sleep. <gasps> Squirrel! Squirrel. Alright. Do 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 do. And what time is it for you right now? It is 524. So I started streaming uh, 24 minutes ago. Uh, time zones are wild. But it's great to have you here. Ah, oh, that... Has to be something to make that go by faster. Do to do. Um. Uh, let's go check on this. Oh wait, first we need to chop down some trees. do 
Cause it's getting a little ridiculous around here. Always oh, crack. Oh, sorry, my bad. I calculate the time wrong. It's good then. It's 7.25 a.m. Well, that's good. Good morning to you. I'm so glad you're not having to watch at 3 a.m. <laughs> Uh, if I believe the trees are a bit out of whack here in Sunhaven too. In the Sunhaven farm. Yep. Chop. Pick. Hang on. Uh... I subscribe to another Canadian YouTuber and sometimes she's streaming too early for me, but a good company... But a good company when I can't sleep. That's good. Yeah, I, uh... Yeah, I am a Canadian VTuber as well. Now you have a Canadian VTuber for when you can't sleep and for when you uh, wake up in the morning. Brain, please work. I am computing a thought. No, I'm not. I'm lying. <laughs> it is seven o'clock. cut down a adolescent tree I need those I cut down all the adult trees but I wait for them to make little trees so then I still have trees going but I also have wood fished in a while. I like fishing. In this, in this game, I can actually do it. Alright, um... Do I have my fishing rod on me? I do. Amazing. Yeah. Come here, fishy. Perfect. I caught a goldfish. Amazing. Is this a survival game? No, this is not a survival game. This is, uh, think Stardew Valley, but with magic. I am a dragon person. Well, technically I'm a demon. That's the race in the game, but I look like a dragon person. I like it. 
Aha. Yoink. Oh, where's the anvil? There's the anvil. It is down there. Anvil. Uh, do, 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 do. I need more. I do not have enough iron. Uh, this is like a farming simulator game. Um, it's very chill, very relaxed, very nice. You do not have to worry about uh, eating or anything. But I'm sorry, my so chat is delayed. Oh no, that's just like it how how it is normal. This is different. All right. Uh, oh no. Oh, uh, it's not going forward. Oh no. Have I done something wrong? But yeah, uh, chat versus uh, me is normally delayed it's so then i don't like drop frames and become a slideshow uh but so yeah it's more of a thing so this is a smoother experience for you guys what is oh god all right Oh no. Black screen. Okay, there we go. Uh do 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 da 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 Uh, what kind of game do you usually stream? Uh, I'm a variety streamer, uh, so it uh, depends on what I've got scheduled for the week. Um, but uh, uh, for instance, tomorrow I am playing... Fuck, what am I playing tomorrow? Uh, but I do have uh, one game that I regularly play once a week. It's Hollow Knight, which is a uh, side-scrolling Metroidvania. It's uh, pretty hard. Oh, I'm playing Tunic tomorrow. It's a, it's a game I have never played before. Here's a cute... Uh, game where essentially... In it's like Zelda, but you're a fox. At least that's how I've been told how it's like. Um, but generally, I play a uh, relaxing kind of... Uh, I, I play between uh, relaxing games and... Um, relaxing games, puzzle games, games with... Uh, high difficulty, that kind of thing. If I could get a, a hand on a copy, I'd probably play Dark Souls on stream. Just generally things that are either relaxing, uh, thought-provoking, or uh, entertaining to watch me fail. Uh, Hollow Knight, that hack and slash? Yep. 
But honestly, it's not the bosses that always get me, it's the platforming. Because I am terrible at platforming. But I love playing it. It is, the, is my absolute favorite game. It is a game I never get tired playing. Alrighty. Lantern Festival is tomorrow. Interesting. subscribe to you how do you want chat to call you alex uh yeah a either alex alexi or uh hey the owl over there because my other form is that of an owl god I'm fine with nicknames as long as you don't go too weird with it. Alright. Uh, I do not have enough room in my inventory for that. Alright, let's go dump some stuff. Let's go. Uh, we have to pet the little weed. And pet the little rock. to have this all done up as long as it as long as it's not babe or honey yeah or sweetheart or whatever because that's kind of weird <laughs> When people get uh, close to uh, or start treading around my uh, boundaries, I will make it known. So it's not, uh, oh, well, this person got timed out because due to not knowing something. I make it very clear. Yeah, parasocial is a no-no for me. Yep. I... It is a no-no for me as well. I... Do not feel comfortable with people being too, uh... I'm not comfortable with people being too personal with me. We are here for a comfy, safe time.
That being said, I do swear quite a bit. <laughs> Not very often in these, uh, in the, in a cozy stream like this. More of when I play something difficult, but you know. Um, I believe we're continuing Cult of the Lamb next week on Sunday. Because we're also playing that. Uh, Cult of the Lamb is really fun. And then, of course, Hollow Knight Tuesdays. Canadian being apologizing a lot, but swearing like a pirate. Yep. <laughs> Canadian in a nutshell. Because uh, I know I can uh, go a little while sometimes with uh, silences, either because I'm concentrating or there's a not, not a lot going on. So I tend to apologize for the silence. <laughs> Is that it be what it be? Let's get these rocks cleared up. Are you in the cold part of Canada? Nah, I'm in southern Canada. Uh, I, w I do not think I would even survive in the cold part of Canada. Because uh, my joints lock up. Uh, something fierce if I get too cold. So I'm pretty sure I would not be even be able to function uh, in the cold part of Canada. I am barely able to function during winters in southern Canada. Here, where I live, it doesn't get too cold, doesn't get too hot. When you compare it to the rest of Canada. Some places like Alberta gets really, really cold in the winter. And really, really hot in the summer. It's weird. It's probably the lack of uh, mountains and trees. You can just see in front of you to the whole horizon. Though that's the same for Saskatchewan and uh, Man uh, parts of Manitoba, I think. I don't know, I I've never been out, out there. I've been to Quebec before though. Great place to visit. Would never live there. Alrighty. Do, 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 do. Also, and the obligatory, please don't ask where I live. That's kind of weird. And I am not obligated to tell anyone because I do not want to dox myself. Do, 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 do. And pickaxe. Fuck yeah. Uh. Oh, it's good then. The cold part sounds like un unreal and too crazy to even think about for me. I mean, minus 40. Right? It got to minus 30 over here. Uh, this winter. I am so glad it is warming up. I would rather be hot than cold. Because at least with heat, I'm still able to uh, move around and function in today in day to day society. I cannot do that when it is too cold. All right, fishy, come here. 
Come, fishy, fishy, fishy. By the bait. Gotcha. Gotcha. And it's a shoe. <laughs> and it's a shoe. All right, now let. Uh, I need to speak to Rosa. Uh, I need. Lantern festivals tomorrow. The cinnaberries aren't done yet. Ah, uh, they'll be finished tomorrow. So I can do that then. All right. I need to get flower for Emma. I need to find Albert's sword. Where is Albert's sword? In the eastern forest. Okay. All right. Where are you, Rosa? Oh, you're up. You're up there. Okay. Touch the water. Uh, I'm in an uh, equatorial region. We're experiencing heat wave currently, but thankfully my region only goes to uh, 33 at peak. Well, that's that's not great, but not bad either. Also obligatory, uh, please don't b dox yourself either on stream. Uh, it's fine to talk about geographical general location, but don't be specific to only your area. Uh, yeah, if you compare it to Thailand, it goes to 45. I hope the people there are safe. Me too. Ow. I hope they're being safe. Uh, also, remember to drink plenty of water. Don't stay in the heat too long. Yada, yada, yada. Please stay cool in this hot time. Wait, what? Temperature is it out right now? Ah, uh, it's the... It's a nice... 20. Nice 20 degrees. Give me the pickaxe. Now I'm gonna sell sell my old one. Wait first. Okay, we can use it. Great. Sell the old boot. Sell the pickaxe. And now we can upgrade something else as well if we have enough. We can upgrade our hoe. Awesome. Amazing. And we have one more. That's... Have anything more? No, no, nope. That is resounding. Nope.
Okay, nothing I need to get done today, today. So I think I'm gonna go over to the mine. Let's go to the mines. Ooh, berry. We're gonna need one of... We need those. Yoink. Was that a goose or a swan? I think it was a swan. No. Yeah, it was a swan. Um, in, on the river there in the game. Oh my god, it's a cute little dinosaur! Uh, if there's magic in the game, there's also monsters and stuff. Yes, there are definitely monsters. See, look, it's a pig bat. It is a monster. Oop. But we are... We are powerful being. The monster is not too bad for us. Okay, we're really looking for ores and stuff. We have plenty of just rocks. Let's just focus on the oars and the way up. Okay, the pig bat didn't drop anything. Plenty of iron ore here, which is good because we need more to get iron keys. Uh, but won't there be something like a boss monster if you're so you're like a retired OP character? No, uh, you're not a retired OP character. There are bosses like in the Western Forest if you go uh, far enough. There's this, uh, Slime King that you can defeat. And, uh, whether or not you- how long it takes to defeat him depends on your combat level. Which is right here. For instance, I have a level- I'm level 9. Because I don't do a lot of- Fighting. I do do a lot of mining, farming, and exploration. Use Rastiki. We shall go forth. Do do do. Big bet. Yeah. Ah, you're stuck in a corner. Ooh, sapphire. So yeah, it's basically just Stardew Valley with magic. Ah, more ore over here. Yummy. I guess in a way, Stardew Valley has some magic, but you're not the one with the magic. 
This is one where we do, where we do have magic. Alrighty, next floor. Uh, is there an end line or just goes on forever like Harvest Moon? I'm not actually sure. I have I've never um Brian, please work. Uh I haven't really gone through this game very far. In fact, the save I have now is probably the farthest I've gone in this game. So, uh, that will be a discovery that we will sh that we shall share. Could you join me on this adventure? Gold, gold. Eh, fuck. Eh, fuck. Like I said, I'm terrible at platforming. Doesn't matter which game it is. Eh. 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 Alright, there we go. Oh, there are no en are there no enemies on this floor? Flame. Not a lot of ore either. Flame. All right, we got the key. Let's go. Rusty key, let's go. Level 14. You know, I should look that I should look that up. Does, uh does seven does Sun Haven Have an end. Uh, give me the game continues after the plot for infinite farming progression. Long after whatever objectives they initially provide are completed. So yeah, it's just a game you can play again for as long as you want. I think after we complete the story though, I'm going to uh, move on to something else. After we get the quote-unquote ending. Uh, yes, there is also crafting. Uh, cause I have- I crafted this pickaxe. It's basically just uh put something on the crafting table have it magic to start creating it out of the materials that you have collected and then yeah who's rusty key of course so I'd say there is crafting in the most rudimentary sense. May I know how to pronounce your name like Alexi Irlan? No, it's not like Ireland. It's uh Ira Lan. Ira Lan. It 
if that makes sense. It's like uh, pronouncing the I as an E, uh, pronouncing the Ra, and then just Lan as in, like, the connection. For, like a Lan connection. I hope I'm making sense. Is there a meaning to it? No. I just put a bunch of... I just put a, a bunch of uh, letters together and it sounded pretty. So I'm, so I'm like, you know what? Let's go with it. Uh, I have no idea what it could mean in other languages because I it is Definitely not English <laughs> Hang on Well, I, well, apparently there is an Iran uh, style of lamp light. So, um, that's interesting to know. Because I tried looking it up. And, uh, yeah, just a bunch of lights. Uh, which artist made your model? It, because it looks very decent. I bought this uh, model off of uh, a, a website called Booth. This was done by uh, the company Ustella, who uh, commissioned a few artists to make up the model. And then they just sold it and I bought it but I would not be able to tell you who specifically made it unfortunately um I would love to so then I could give them credit but unfortunately that is uh not possible <laughs> VTuber models are expensive, by the way. Uh, what's your lore? I currently do not have lore. Uh, other than, um... I am an owl god that got very, very bored and decided to start streaming video games. Because why not? I mean, the other gods are doing it, so... And it's fun. So why not? Doot doot. Okay, good. I can't, I can use it. Of course I can use it. It's only... Anyway. Uh... Honestly, um... If I think of anything more than that, I'll make a lore video and post it on my channel. Because you know it's inter it's interesting. Sleep. 
Yes. Why isn't it auto doing it when I go into the bed? That is weird. Uh. Please, I'm interacting, I promise. I'm I'm pressing the buttons. Let me go. Please. Yeah, I know. Uh, I've watched a VTuber to that do the illustration and rigging her model by herself. Just the model alone gonna be like hundreds of layers, like damn so much work. I'm actually working on uh, drawing my own model. And let me tell you, it is pain and suffering. That shit is gonna take me like five years to make. But I'm still gonna try. Please let me play the game. Uh. Yeah, if it, did, d d it, if it doesn't let me go, I'm probably gonna have to end stream because it probably crashed. Hello? Please. Do something. Please. I'm an impatient bean. I'm an impatient owl. I need to play the game. What is the interact button? Please. I'm just an impatient little owl. I, I want to play the game. What is happening? What is going on? I have so much respect for someone like that who can do such detailed work. Yep. So do I. Cause that shit's hard. Please! Why it's stuck? I don't know. I don't know why it's stuck. Which button is the interact button? <gasps> One of the buttons I pressed worked. All right, let's figure it out. Which button is the interact button? And it key binds. Interact. E! All right, then I just have to press E. <laughs> oh, smack, maybe we'll fix it. Uh, yeah, uh, that was just me being dumb. I just needed to press E. Everything is okay now. Uh, skipping basic tutorial is such a classic gamer move. I didn't skip the tutorial. I'm just dumb and forget buttons. Like, I will press a button for a thing. Like, you know... Inter the interact button 
But the moment you put me on the spot and tell me to press a button by its specific action that it completes when you press that button, I will immediately forget what that button is to do that thing. Because I am dumb. <laughs> All right, nothing there. Well, I'm only dumb sometimes. I'm really good at puzzle games. <laughs> Though I think that doesn't, I, I guess that doesn't really count. So we know Alex can't handle pressure too well. Uh, and that depends. If you are you sure about that? Yes, I am. I am sure about that. I am good at puzzle games. Um, when I have a functioning brain cell. A lot of the time, I have half a brain cell working. It's not a lot, but it's something. <laughs> Why did I come here? Oh, right. I was going to convert my mana into money. So then I can do... This thing. That quest. Uh, no one said you had to be smart to be a god. You just not have to know how to do the thing that you are the god of. And I am the god of bad luck. I... am really not lucky when it comes to anything that has to do with luck. I will always l Uh, and chaos. If chaos demands I win despite the bad luck, then I will still win. It depends on which is stronger. The bad luck or the chaos. Uh, what am I doing? Construction table. I need a hundred of that. There we go. Uh, it's good that it prevents you from wasting your money on gotcha and gamble. As I always say on my streams, please gotcha with responsibility. Make sure that all of your bills are paid and everything important is already taken care of. If you will go hungry if you do a certain gotcha, then don't do it. Or I will be very disappointed in you. Turn into Catherine. I do play gotcha games sometimes. Like, uh, I really want to stream. Uh, Honkai Star Rail. I'll probably stream it next week.
Uh, but yeah. Because it, it's really fun, but uh, because they're doing... Uh, some people need more waifu than they need food. I beg to differ. Not starving to death, I think, is much more important. Honestly, I would rather not... Oh shit, that's right, I have more! I have more... stuff. Monkai Star Rail, ooh, spicy. Uh, I've played it a little bit on my own, but I do plan... I'm not gonna do the save that I already have. I'm probably going to go on to another server and uh, do it so then it's fresh. So then when people are watching, they don't have to already know certain things about the game. So then it's a nice experience for everyone. Cause I'm awesome like that. <sighs> Alright. my coal. Did I put it back in the chest? Yes, I did. I don't play that many games, but enjoy watching people play them. Uh, I am... The same, I'm the same way. Well, actually, that's a lie. I do play a lot of games. Um, I just also like to watch other people play it. get uh understand what uh how other people react to things Jude's favorite song for you to play whenever you'd like. That's adorable. Put those there. So then we don't accidentally, like, sell them. Alright. Awesome. Now we should have enough planks to get to do that upgrade. Yes, we do. Uh, maybe I'm just bad at games or I unconsciously avoid avoiding a bad habit of mine when I'm on a game. I have lack of self-control. Sometimes I go a whole day just playing a game. 
That is why I have multiple, and I do mean multiple, uh, alarms for everything. Uh, do you like animes or following Japanese culture, Alex? Uh, yes, I do. Um... Currently, I am going through, um... Demon Slayer. Which I'm enjoying immensely. Ah, weeb. I appreciate good art. And animation is an art. Sorry, I like anime, especially hentai. No, just kidding. I like anime. Alrighty. Let's put... Wait. Can't put it down somewhere because it's not mine. I must give it to the person who lost it. Meow. Uh, Demon Slayer is certainly a satisfying one to watch. I agree. Right, house. I have an extra house in my inventory, uh, but I can't bear to have to wait a week, so I straight up read the manga. I usually wait until most of the anime is out already. Or, like you said, I read the manga. I am also watching, um, uh, I reincarnated into a sword. Or I reincarnated as a sword? Whichever. That's a good anime. You can find it to, uh, it's... You can find it on High Dive, the str anime streaming platform. Hi, Mina. How's it going?
And the main character is okay. But I love Fran. She's amazing. Uh, you're the same type as my friend. She'll be saving anime episode and binge watching it later. Doing better? That's good. Uh, sometimes I will watch it as it comes out when I'm watching with friends. If uh, we're all invested in watching it uh, every week. As a kind of, uh, as a kind of weekly thing. Which I don't really do much of nowadays. Um, I haven't watched that. Maybe I'll check it out. Definitely worth a watch. Uh, you do have to have a subscription to High Dive though to watch it, but it is completely worth it. Uh, leaves cookies for the Alex. I accept the cookies. Do, do, do. Summer Scarecrow. I need 10 wheat. Do I have 10 wheat? How much wheat? I have 33. I have enough. Give me one Summer Scarecrow and a Fall Scarecrow and a Winter Scarecrow. Give me all the Scarecrows. I have the Spring right now. Okay. Meet the frog. Right. I don't think this is a kind of voice though. Holy voice crack. Oh, <laughs> uh, when your voice has decided it's going to change. Voice starts acting up all over the place. It's a good change. But slightly annoying. Remember Genshin event. Right, I have to do that sometime today after stream. I'm off. It's my off days, but I still have chores to do. So yeah, thank you for the chat, Alex. Have fun and see you later. I hope you have good chores. I know it's probably not great to to have to do them, but I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And I hope you enjoyed. I am going I am actually going to stop stream now because it is time for me to go eat dinner. Ah, so I hope everyone enjoyed. I hope you all have an absolutely wonderful day and remember to be kind and that includes to yourself. <laughs>